Good morning, Richard Eckley here. Happy Wednesday morning to you. It's not too bad a day here in Swansea. A little bit cloudy overcast, but nothing major. Um, we're on a Wednesday. We're on a Relationship Wednesday on your four keys to a healthier and happier you. And I was reading an article the other day saying in a, when you're in relationships, um, sometimes we do, it's what we do when we start with a relationship. We sort of try and put our best selves forward, which is how we should do, really. You should try and, yes, attract a good partner. So you do we put your best selves, best selves forward. But then you should eventually sort of just just sort of fall into who you actually are, and you shouldn't try and change yourself to be something else for someone else. Because if you're in a long-term relationship, you're going into a long-term relationship. You need to be yourself, and if you can't be yourself with your partner who you think is going to be long-term, then that's not a good start off. So obviously, we do put our best selves first forward when we're in a relationship. But then we do need to just be ourselves and just be able to relax and just and just not try and sort of change ourselves. To think we're trying to be someone our partner would want us to be because that's not who we are at core we need to be ourselves at core just to have a healthy happy life so if we're always trying to be someone else or trying to keep someone else happy we can't be truly happy in ourselves because we're not being ourselves so we do need to be ourselves first make good ourselves for our own happiness first that's a bit selfish in a way but you put your own happiness first because if you're happy in yourself then you can help other people you can sort of less be more sort of provide more sort of help and friend and chat and stuff like that because you're okay in yourself and your core and then you sort of you've got your correct partner with you then you're you're, you're, you're fine because your partner should love you for who you are you shouldn't your partner shouldn't be wanted to change you into who they want you to be because you should, should be you if they if you're attracted to your other partner then you should actually be yourself and they should love you for who you are not trying to sort of change you into to the to who they think you should be if you know what i mean and it's quite tricky in relationships because we all gone so we all come into different beliefs different sort of um experiences we've had through life and it's, it's quite hard to sort of just get that just to be yourself and the first to start off with you sort of you do just as i said put your best self first forward but then just to be yourself and just eventually just thinking well yeah no just want to be me and then just be happy because that's what sometimes happens sort of long term down the road five ten years down the road someone's tried to be what their partner wanted them to be and they can't keep it up anymore they've done it for so many years and they just i just want to be me and that's just how you should be to be happy in yourself you just got to be yourself and we've all got weird quirks and personality traits and things like that and, it, and it's just being yourself and you're happy in yourself and that's just how it should be so it's always best just to be yourself and then yes hopefully you'll find the right partner and then they'll support you because there's ever someone will always find someone who loves you for you or a little quirks where you think a bit crazy and someone think that's actually lovely so it's just yes so it is just always be yourself and just 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 sort of relax and just just enjoy life and go through and just don't try and make, make yourself someone you're not just be yourself at core because then you are ultimately who you are and you'll be much happier in life that's my little thought on relationship today. Have you have a good day today? You got any value from this? We'll drop me some comments below. We're still sticking a, a podcast system all together at the moment, and uh, then get me a website web uh, web page up, and that's all. Sort of, I've got it. We haven't actually put all the stuff on it yet, and then obviously the books hopefully coming coming out soon as well. It's in the editing process. So if you've got any value from this, we'll drop me some comments below, uh, and all the best for now.